day. Um, so hey guys, so I just want to do a quick hair update. I actually got highlights today. <laughs> um, so if you've been following my journey, I went natural almost five years ago. I have not used relaxer. I did use relaxer for about 20 something years before that. Uh, my hair gets really, really pinned straight. I take care of it a lot by putting like oils in it. Um, I use hemp seed oil. I use a rice bran oil. I use coconut oil. Um, I'm going to start feeding my, my hair by using um, avocado, you know, and mashing it up and putting it in your hair, and using um, mayonnaise, but I'm going to make my own, which is just eggs, oil, and vinegar. And then you mix it all together um, and you put it in your hair because I believe that hair is alive. Everybody's like, hair is dead. I don't think so. I think your hair is alive and if you feed your hair like you would your skin cells, it will grow strong. So I got highlights today and I kind of like it. At first I didn't like it because when it's wet, it looked orange and black like Halloween. But when she dried it, it looked like this. So I figure I'm going to do it one more time. And then it'll be blonder, and then I'm going to let it grow and let it have like that ombre effect. I'm really excited. It was so random. Never even thought about it. I just walked in, and I'm like, I think I want to get highlights today. Because I didn't want to cut my hair. I was going to cut my hair again. Short, but it's just too much work to try to get it long. And it's getting, it's getting much longer. It used to be down to here, and then I asked her to cut the ends, and she cut it like that much. Just like two inches. I was so furious, but whatever. Um, but this is my hair. All I did was blow dry it, like straight from, they washed it and she did the highlights and then I just had her blow dry it. This is what it looks like blow dried with a round brush, but it's from a Dominican salon. So what they do is they have somebody come in and then alter their blow dryers and it's like the devil got in there. It's so hot that it burns everything. Like it burns your ears, it burns your scalp, it burns, but it looks amazing and it lasts, you know, over a week if you, you know, really maintain it. Um, I went to a salon on 104th Street in Corona. It's like 104th and 38, 37th, 37th Avenue and 104th Street. Um, it's like the only place I go. I went to a lot of salons before that, but this one actually makes my hair grow. They're Christian. They pray for people all the time. Like. Every time you walk in, they're like, "Ay, por favor, Dios, ayuda a esta mujer." I'm like, "Okay." So it's like really positive energy. Um, but I just wanted to share that with you guys. Everybody said that I shouldn't dye my hair because it's so thin, and it is very thin and fragile. But I figure since I'm gonna just be doing the masks and stuff all the time and putting oils in my hair this summer, that it's just gonna feed it and I'll be okay. I'm also gonna use Wen because Wen is really good for when you have color treated hair and you want it to grow strong, so I'm only gonna use one. I'm not gonna use any of my other products until, you know, like, I feel like this is kind of like, okay, you know? But in the very, very beginning of coloring your hair, I wanna kinda keep it simple. So, that's my hair. I just wanna do the quick hair update. Love you guys, bye.